A man that police say is responsible for a heinous attack on an elderly woman in Detroit this week faced a judge today. Police say he offered to help shovel the woman's driveway, but instead assaulted her with a shovel and then stole her car. And then we have Jen Shans taking a look at what happened when this man was arraigned. Jen. Yeah, Amira and Brian, a judge granted 20 year old Sean Lacey a $1 million cash bond, no 10% due to the violent nature of this crime. And in court today, a detective working this case spoke about it and said that 72 year old victim had to have surgery due to a brain bleed following this vicious attack. The 20 year old man police say is responsible for brutally attacking and carjacking an elderly woman Thursday was emotionless in court during his arraignment today. In court, an undercover detective described the attack. Mr. Basie was caught on video surveillance several times. That we, it was too many, too many to count. According to Detroit police, Sean Lacey offered to shovel the 72 year old woman's driveway, something neighbors say he'd done in the past. This is someone that had been doing this work for her for a number of years. Uh, he does her, her lawn and landscaping, little, 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 little bits. So she obviously had a sense of trust about him. But this time, police say the woman didn't have money to pay for the service and said no. That's when police say Lacey hit her in the head with the shovel several times and then stole her car, leading officers on a short chase. There's a last that Mr. Um, Lacey struck another vehicle, fell from the vehicle, fell from the officers, causing a manhunt. Uh, concluding with his arrest and being taken into custody. Now, in addition to that high bond, Lacey is ordered, of course, to not see this victim who, again, remains in the hospital. The judge said today if he does happen to make bond, he will be ordered to have a GPS tether prior to his next court date. We, of course, will continue to follow this developing story. Live tonight on the city's west side, Chen Chance, 7 Action News.